guys, so if you've watched my last couple of videos, then you know that I'm going to be taking a trip to the beach here in a couple of days. And my last couple of videos, basically, I just showed you guys what I'm taking on my trip. So the first video was what I'm taking in my travel makeup bag. The second one was just like an overview of my suitcase in general with everything that I've packed. And then today I'm going to kind of show a more detailed version of just what toiletries I'm going to be bringing and what I think are essentials to pack for a vacation. So I have all of my things here to show you. I did a video like this a while back and a lot of you really liked it and it helped a lot of you out so I thought that I would do it again because that was two years ago so things are a little different now. So anyways when I like to pack I like to put everything in just bags like this. I think it um, if something spills then you don't have to worry about it and I think it just condenses everything down and just makes it easier to pack. So if you watch my what's in my suitcase video you'll see how I just place these things in my suitcase. They fit perfectly. Um, so it may seem like I have a lot of bags but the way that um, I packed everything and stuff it worked out really nicely. So I'm just going to go ahead and show you what's in each bag. So this one kind of has kind of random products but like skincare stuff and hair and things like that. So I always have to bring skincare products obviously. My face wash is more in my like shower bag because I always use my face wash you know in the morning when I'm taking a shower. So my toner and stuff is in here. So this is just the it's called Equate Beauty Deep Cleaning Astringent and it was comparable to the Clean and Clear Sensitive Skin Astringent but this one was cheaper so I bought this one. So I have that in there. I have my Sonia Kashuk Eye Makeup Remover which is right here. I have my Clinique Dramatically Different Moisturizing Gel and then I have, I guess I can take some of these things out to show you better. I have my It's a 10 Leave-In, um, this is a hair product, and this is the only hair product that I'm bringing with me because it's, it basically does everything that I need it to do, so this is all I'm bringing. And then I'm just bringing a little mini travel lotion. This is the Bali Mango from Bath & Body Works, so just a little one. And then I'm taking a little nail polish remover. So that was everything in here. And then I have one thing of nail polish that I'm bringing, but I already showed that in my travel makeup bag. Okay, so then I have my shower bag. So this is everything from that. And in here I have a loofah because I, I don't know, I just have to shower with one of these. I don't really like washcloths, so I love using these. And then I have a pink Venus razor, and it has the little cap on it, so, you know, if I'm reaching down in the bag, I don't cut myself. And then I have my face wash, and this is a brand new one, but this is the Clean and Clear Essentials Foaming Facial Cleanser for Sensitive Skin. And then I just have Travel Size Shampoo and Conditioner. So these are the Clear Scalp and Hair Therapy, the Total Care Shampoo and Conditioner. So that's what those look like. And I like these because they're travel size, but they're not like super, super mini, whereas I'm going to be scared that I'm going to run out. Um, these are actually like a perfect size to travel with. I really like this a lot. And then I just have a little mini body wash. This is Caress Tahitian Renewal. And I don't know if I'll have to end up getting another one of these because I don't know how much I'm going to use. But for right now, that's what I have packed. So just little mini travel sizes of things. So that was my shower bag. And then I have, like, let's see. I have Q-tips and cotton pads in this bag because I I have to have Q-tips, like, every single day. I either clean my ears or I use it for makeup or there's just so many things that Q-tips come in handy for, so I always like to have those. And then I have cotton pads for, like, my nail polish remover or my skincare stuff. I need to have cotton pads, so that's that. And then I, of course, have my toothbrush and toothpaste, so that's in there. I just have a crest little mini um, toothpaste. And I could bring mouthwash and floss and all that stuff, but I just think it's easier to bring this. I mean, one week isn't going to kill me without going with that stuff. And then in this bag, I have just my Degree deodorant and my Coach Poppy Blossom perfume. So I'm only bringing one perfume. I don't need more than one. And then I also, um, we still have to go to the store and pick up some sunscreen and aloe, but I have this Ocean Potion Dark Tanning Extreme Intensifier with Instant Bronzer. And I actually used this when I went tanning, so I'm just going to use it for the beach as well. 
So I'm going to bring that. And then you need a hairbrush. So I also have like um, hair ties and bobby pins, but those are in my makeup bag if you watch that video. Um, if you want to bring like a comb or something, that might be nice too. Um, technically, you're supposed to brush your hair out with a wide tooth comb when you get out of the shower. But um, my hair is really easy to comb through when I get out of the shower, so I don't feel like I'm breaking it. So I pretty much just use this. Um, and that's all I'm going to need. I'm not going to be like teasing my hair or doing anything with a comb or anything like that. So that's all I need. I'm just making this trip as simple as possible because I know I've overpacked so many times in the past. But yeah, this is all I really need. So basically these are my essentials. And then I am bringing a curling iron because I do enjoy curling my hair as I did today. Um, hang on, my camera is about to die. Okay, still have a little bit of time. So this is a, uh, not a Connor, this is a Hot Tools 1 inch curling iron and it's my favorite. I really like it. And if you just wrap your hair around, I have a tutorial up, but it makes your hair like just really beachy and kind of laid back. So I like using that for that. And then I have a hair dryer. This is the Conair um, Ionic Cord Keeper. And actually this cord was supposed to be one of those ones where you push the button and it like brings the cord up. So it's nice to travel with. But my button broke, of course, so I had to just wrap it around. So yeah, I'm bringing my hair dryer. So those are basically all of my essentials that I'm taking with me on my trip. And then my makeup bag is something completely different. So if you want to watch that video, if you haven't already, I will link that in the bottom bar down below. As well as my just overview of what I'm taking with me, like my clothes and stuff. And then I'm also going to be doing like a travel outfit idea and um, things to like take either on a plane with you or I happen to be traveling by car so things that I'm going to be taking in the car with me. So stay tuned for those videos and I thank you so much for watching and I will talk to you later. Bye.